Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. I am Romek, the wielder of the Infinity Gauntlet and the leader of the Snap Mini. And today with Thanos, I bring to you, in my opinion, the best Thanos list. And requires one thing. It requires you having a boy named Scar, Cool Obsidian, and Crossbones. And you will be the Thanos Slayer once more. With us even winning a mirror in the final game and almost being undefeated. Besides one opponent winning like a very, very... Having a specific hand winning one, like one cube off of us. It was absolutely fire. This deck is amazing. But now in decade, I'll tell you why. Well, we utilize the Hope Summers engine along with, you know, having the Mind Stone, etc. We're basically trying to ramp into all of the good stuff from our deck like leech and blink and this is all of course best like you know it's topped off based off like mockingbird scar magneto helping you pull the opponent's stuff blob just being a huge idiot and it all seems like a normal standard issue of Thanos list but then you realize one little interaction blink can pull big cards even though their infinity stones are very small so that means she can sometimes bring out a hope summers she can bring out a nocturne she can bring out a leech she can sometimes bring out a blob like randomly blob on turn five and suddenly the opponent's like well, I didn't expect that will come from a reality stone, and then you win the game. It's very, like, it's a very uncontrolled deck, just like Thanos is. Thanos is always feast or famine, and when you start famining, you need to know when to snap. It's a very, very important thing to know with, when you're playing Thanos. So when you draw stuff like Mind Stone and the early game stones, you really need to snap early, or you'll just get, you know, shanked into the ends of the sun. You will get disintegrated. You will just die, but you need to learn how to play Thanos. So I really suggest watching the video till the end, because this deck is very, very, hard to play but boys if you enjoyed the video make sure to give it a quick like comment subscribe make sure of course follow my twitch channel below where we might be streaming even right now i don't know boys but what i know is we should get snapping oh yeah guys today we're playing thanos i know everyone is screaming no! but yeah we're playing Thanos. i'm just gonna play a few quick games of thanos because he's kind of back and i'm gonna play a different kind of shell because everyone is just playing him and uh Leech Blink, Leech Blink, Leech Blink. And we're kind of bored of Leech Blink. I want to play something different. I want to play something base. So I put in the Crossbone Scar shell. Yes, I quite like Crossbone Scar. It's my like one of my favorite shells in the game. Oh my god, the Nexus is either the best thing ever or the worst thing ever, depending on how the matchups usually go. Seeing them pass three turns really gives me a question. What are they, what are they up to? Hmm... I can give them a copy of Nocturne. Yeah, I will. I might clog their hand also. Let's see. Nocturne. Oh. Galactus? What, is it Galactus? Okay. Oh, it's Tribunal. Well, we're dead. Wait, are we dead at all? I'm, I'm kind of setting him up for Thin Ice. Like, he needs to have Iron Man right now. And I kind of clogged his hand with Nocturne. I can try to swap... Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, okay. Miss Dazzler into Patriot. Uh, the, if we had Magneto, this would be the easiest game of all time, but... Hmm. The tide of the game is shifting dramatically. Yeah, the Nexus is a real issue. Like, we never overpower Onslaught Wave Dazzler, probably. It's really hard to beat. But I'll stay, because I'm a content creator. I have to do these types of things. Plus, this should be the Patriot. Fine. Okay, oh my god, we won. I didn't expect it. Like I thought we were dead. We had most of our payoffs well and good, but still. Oh my god. Sometimes you just need to clench your butt cheeks and say, you know what, maybe just, they just don't play Iron Man. What do I know? If they played Iron Man, we would be as dead as Disco or as dead as X Thanos was because Thanos is still not in the best case. But Thanos is way better right now. Like, I think the Leech Blink engine is absolutely good for him. We've drawn one of the worst hands possible, which is just no Infinity Stones. No Infinity Stones is the worst place you can be in if you're playing Thanos. 
And them having a Red Hulk really does not make it any better. We get an Infinity Stone to our hand anyway from Sanctuary 2. We get a Reality Stone. Can we get another stone, perhaps? That'd be pretty good. Thank you, we got a Space Stone. That's alright. We'll swap out the negative zone, because we really like clogging stuff. Like, like, we really like having a lot of cards in the lane. Dream Dimension, I'll live with it. There's the Blink. We just need to play on Curve now. And getting this... Crossbones down is very important. Okay, so I'll play Hope Summers in Sanctuary. Don't please be big. Okay. Actually, our worst matchup. Oh, shit. Well, that is really bad. I can do the leech line. Fine, I guess that's what the deck is supposed to do, but still. It still lets us do it, because Sanctuary too. but fuck, this is really bad. And if they have a leech of their own, we're kind of dead. Nocturne. Into a one cost, which is Korg. Yeah, Darkhawk has a really good time against Thanos, if you guys didn't know. Which is quite ironic, considering the lore, but fuck me. I didn't expect that to happen. There's the reality stone. I have to blink. That's a leech. That's a Hope Summers, actually. So, this becomes, a uh, Scar! No, not him. I quite wanted to play him. Yeah, I kind of wanted to play him, but now there's no, like, no, no cigar for that. Oof. I'm reliant on him moving the jet. I think we lose in almost all scenarios, but still, I'm willing to play it out. If there was no Dream Dimension, we actually won every single time. He has 6 energy. I don't know what he's cooking up, but... He can move right. That loses us the game. He'll play Dark Hawk mid. That instantly wins Sanctuary 2, and the rest of I just need to think about. Fuck it, I think he'll move. Okay! Dang! We beat our worst matchup! We beat Darkhawk because we got Hope Summers. Like, our hand might have sucked, but we still managed to clutch it up at the end because Blink gave us... Well, not the worst target, but one of the worser targets. I don't want to give 5 energy for Scar, I want to give 2 energy for Scar. That's why we run Crossbones, damn it. Like, that's the entire reason why I'm playing the deck like I'm playing it. Everyone always complains about... Man, everyone's just playing the same type of Thanos deck. So I want to do something different. We have Hope Summers. Please, no Red Hulk in hand. Okay. An Infinity Stone is where we kind of want to be. Oh. Yeah, I hate that. Thanks. Thanks, I hate it. A Surfing Prof. Whoa. That is so bad. Actually, unforgivably terrible. I, if he snaps, I'm gonna leave. There's no way I'm gonna stay against the lockdown deck with Savage Land. He has a Nocturne, I'm guessing. Oh my god, we drew the Reality Stone. Hey, it's random turbo. Might be good. So it is just a prop X. He clogged himself. Oh god, this is... This is some shit. I'll tell you right now. This swaps out the reality stone. I, we're gonna lose because of fucking Savage Land clogging us completely. Like, I wanna play... You know what, fuck it, let's go. Sarah, yeah, you're clogged now, bitch. Nobody gets to play cards now. Besides you in Savage Land. Please be good. That is the worst one. That is actually the worst stone. Actually the worst stone, okay. Mockingbird wins, maybe. That's a mockingbird. That's really good. Holy shit. I gotta whisper it. 
But like, but it's... Blink swaps out the Magneto. That sucks. I don't want that. Uh, Scar into a Jeffy into a Soulstone into a Mockingbird. It requires quite a specific hand to win. I'll actually bring out the Scar on right and do everything in the same. Okay. Need Surfer. Okay, I think I did right by playing a Scar on the right. He needs, like... He needs a lot. Oh, man. Absolute perfect hand. Yeah, that was the exact... The combination of cards. That's what I was thinking about. I was like, it needs to be Gl Forge, Gladiator, Surfer, and he had... Uh, the, the way people just have, like, one card in hand, and they're like, Oh, man, I sure destroyed you, didn't I? Yeah, great job, you idiot. Ugh, why is everyone such an asshole in this game? Someone would say, but Omic, you could have maybe fished out for the blob. Yeah, but it needed to be the most specific hand, and then I would still lose to not having any power on left. I mean, if we did that way, he could have played it in the reverse order, like, it doesn't matter, it was a 50-50, it was just where he's playing it. And Funny Bones again, they're all playing, like, similar decks. It's all Lockdown based, or Leech Leader, not Leech Leader, Leech uh, Blink based decks. Mojo World? Oof, rough hand. Yeah, it's Lockdown. I mean, it has to be. Like, you gotta uh, decrease the skill of the game in some way. Okay, Onslaught Citadel. Okay, I'm gonna throw down Mockingbird. Oh, alright. I can deal with that, mostly. It's like an early game lockdown deck. This is gonna be the Miss Marvel lane. I can tell. No, 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 no. I can still keep playing in flooding. No, no, no. I guess I baited him out. I'm playing in ways he cannot possibly comprehend. I don't think I removed the flooding now. Yeah. That's a doom. Has to be. Alright. Ooh. He probably plays something like... Okay, let's see. Miss Marvel wins the flooding. Yeah, Miss Marvel wins the flooding lane. But this way we can kind of fuck him up. Like, there's a lot of things that can go bad here for him. He needs Miss Marvel, which I'm guessing he does have. He could also play a Vision. If it is Miss Marvel, though, then we move the Nocturne mid, we mag on right. No, 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 then we still lose because Onslaught Citadel gives him so much. In which case. We do it like this. Okay. Xandar. Wow, that's really good for him, I guess. Oh, Miss Marvel is now disabled. Maximus and Miss Marvel? I, I guess. 
It's the lockdown deck. Yeah, he lost the game because he didn't think about it. I did. I was very much... If we lost that, it was due to a 50-50 of us pulling, ho like, Storm instead of Hope Summers. Otherwise, we always win. Oh my god, that was such a good showcase of it. Let's play one more game with good old Thanos. Yeah, like, who knew Thanos was still good, even despite us not playing... I mean, we didn't even get to showcase Blink Leech. Like, who cares? I don't want to play fucking Blink Leech. That shit's annoying. Like, ah, it's sad to see that the best engine for Leech is the one we everyone thought of day one. Like, oh my god, it's a mirror. The final game is a mirror. Okay, one open... Basically, we opened the same one. We drew Mockingbird. This will be a very interesting game. Xandar, there it is from previous game. <sighs> oh my god, we have Mindstone. I if we he doesn't have Mindstone, we're very heavily favored to win. Oh my god. Well that might do it. We have to play Mockingbird because that idiot is still a card. Oh god, we clogged our hand. Behold my cloggy hand. Uh, I'll do it like this. I'm actually not uh, thinking of not playing the Reality Stone. But okay. Mind Stone, so he does have it, and he wants to clog us for some reason. That doesn't seem like a good idea. He got the Power Stone, pretty rough for him. Westview, ah, uh, we'll get to see what's the final location next turn. Well, there's Blink. Not like we'll get to use her, though, but... We'll see about Westview, maybe we get to use her. This is like, kind of gas, I'm not gonna lie, this is all kind of good. We have so many good hits with Blink. All we need is for it not be Mobius and Mobius and we're pretty good. There's the Thanos becoming 20 attack right now. A uh, Soul Stone, we both played the Soul Stone. Mockingbird, into Reality Stone. Oh. Oh, no. Things have heavily, heavily escalated. But Blink! Unless that becomes Leech, in which case, shit. But, like, okay. We, he, we have Reality Stone. That's the thing. And the picture of the thing. That's the thing, guys. You gotta realize that. That's the thing. I have an idea. Blink, come on. Anything but... Leech. Well, there's the leech. Uh, he really did come. Well... I mean, boys, it's... Time to do the old switcheroo. Who has more power here? He does. If anything, I'm supposed to... Uh, it's such a hard turn to do. It all heavily relies, relies on... Does he think about me using Reality Stone on the Nexus? Wimp till the very end, huh? There we go. We win the game. I think he forgot that Thanos is not 20 attack anymore, but still. We won the final Thanos mirror, proving we're the true wielder of the Infinity Stones. Let's go back to deck edit. 
All you need is one scary boy, you need a little bit of power with Call of Zidane Crossbones, and you got the magic cooking up. Yeah, this deck is absolutely... It's really good. It's the best Thanos deck, I think, by a mile. Now, someone would say, maybe playing the Scar package is not the best, but hey, those people don't have fun. Those people just want to play the most hardcore of metas. Have a little fun, why don't you? And Leech Blink is also pretty good, despite us getting the worst hit with Blink and Leech being just a really low-powered idiot. We could have gotten something like, you know, Blob, etc., which would be way better in the final game. And we still managed to win it. Thanos feels really good right now. I think he's one of the better decks to actually play if you know how to play Thanos at all. But yeah, some decks that are way more brain dead are way easier to play and actually are better. So, you know, use caution. But if you really like Thanos, I think it's finally time to maybe dust them off a little bit. But boys, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a quick like, comment, subscribe, make sure that of course, follow my Twitch channel below, where we stream on Mondays and Fridays. Maybe I'll be even streaming right now. Who knows? Check it out. I was Ramek, the leader of the Snap Media. Love you all, and take care of yourselves.